So far this election season, the Democratic candidates for governor have yet to hold any sort of forum or debate. Now that was supposed to change tomorrow, but was abruptly canceled. WJTV 12's Alex Love joins us in the studio with the details and reaction. Alex. Melanie was meant to take place July 17th with the help of the Jackson State Public Television outlet airing a pre-recorded forum of the top three Democrat candidates speaking with a moderator. Well, with that opportunity gone, the two that wanted the forum to take place are now calling out their opponent. Three weeks out from the primary election, Attorney General Jim Hood, Hines County District Attorney Robert Smith, and Valicia P. Williams sit as the top three for the party nominee. The county committee had criteria, certain criteria um, that the candidates had to meet in order to be, you know, uh, a part of, of that particular platform. When candidates Smith and Williams were notified of this forum, they say they immediately made time in their schedules. I was more than interested because I had been pushing for and asking for a debate. And then uh, the fact that uh, it was scheduled, I cleared my schedule because I thought it too important not to. I moved everything around. Um, this issue is not new. Um, I was the first one to call for a debate uh, many months ago. The Hines County Democratic Party arranged for the candidates to each answer five questions from a moderator about key issues in the state. But candidate Jim Hood claimed to have a schedule conflict and offered to pre-record yeah. his answers ahead of time. Organizers denied that option, so the attorney general backed out, forcing the event to cancel. He feel privileged, uh, has a sense of privilege that he doesn't have to participate without giving explanation of who he is, what he stands for, and what he will do for Mississippians. That is a slap in the voters' face, not to address uh, important issues while people are suffering every single day, these career politicians just want to be elected. In a statement, the Hood campaign said in part, quote, only three of the eight Democratic candidates were invited. This threw up a red flag because parties are supposed to remain neutral and should not discriminate against other candidates. The attorney general's schedule is set several weeks out and he was booked on that date. Hood's campaign also says they were not offered an alternative date. Now, the Hines County Democratic Party said they will try to hold a new forum or debate in the in the time coming, though Robert Smith says he, he will likely not have time due to his commitment to talk to voters. Valicia Williams, on the other hand, said she will debate anyone, anytime and anywhere.